how to create a landing page in Gumroad. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Many of you will ask how we can make a landing page into our Gumroad platform. The process is very easy. So for those who doesn't know how to create a landing page, it is going to be the digital product that you have put into Gumroad. It is going to create a landing page or a product page for it. So you do not need here a, a third party app or a platform to create that landing page. So all you need to do is to head over gumroad.com, sign in for an account or sign up if you do not have an account, then you are going to visit your dashboard. Here, how we can create that landing page. So you are going to head over the products, as you can see from the left side of the screen. This is the general menu of the Gumroad platform. So here we have some, as you can see, products, memberships, and etc. And if you have noticed, we have a, uh, let's say a submenu or not a submenu, but a subdomain created on the name of Gumroad of each one of the products. For example, here, as you can see, we have a, a slug uh, and also the uh, subdomain of uh, Gumroad. Here we have uh, smithjack3.gumroad.com slash uh, ebook. So as you can see, when you are going to create a product, it is going to create a landing page for that product. And you are going to design that landing page by having here the illustration for the product and also some information like the title and also the description. And for the, uh, let's say here, the checkout, it is going to be integrated within the button of buy this or the call, call to action. So you are going to uh, publish or showcase the size and also the resolution of the file and also the type of it. So let's say here that we have, or this is the first time that you are going to create a product. You're going to head over a new product. From here, you are going to select either a digital product, course, tutorial, or ebook, memberships, bundles, commissions, calls, coffees. So here we have the services for the commissions, calls, and coffees are going to be Maybe some, let's say, paying in invoice um, type of uh, services. So let's stick to the digital product. So I'm going to type in here a name for the digital product. Let's say here, maybe new year, for example, uh, cover illustration. This creation. And we are going to click on customize. Uh, now you need to set up the uh, price. As you can see here, we have the price unit. You can uh, use one of the uh, price units that are available. Nearly all the currencies are, are available. So I'm going to put here this price. Then we are going to click on uh, save. So what we're we going to do here is to set up the name, the description, and the URL. As you can see, the slug of that specific uh, product page that we want. So basically here we have the uh, name. We are going to set up the title. As you can see, you are going to see the preview or the live preview of that specific landing page that you are going to create for your product. Now for the, let's say here, the URL, you cannot uh, change that because it is going to be here a subdomain for uh, Gumroad. If you have a custom domain, you can go ahead and put your domain in here and then you are going to have only a slug or a page for it. So I'm going to put in here new, an abbreviation of new or something like new year like that. Uh, let's say here, new year cover. So we are going to stick with that. Then you're going to set up here the covers. So I'm going to install something like here an image. Let's add an image in here. This is just an example. So you can go ahead and ignore and add the covers. And then you're going to set up the thumbnail for that. It is going to showcase in here. And finally, you are going to head over the call to action. For example, we have pay, buy this, and I want this. So you're going to set up here the summary. For example, the, that what the client is going to get. Also some details, integration, if you are going to demand from the clients that has bought or have bought at the, uh, let's say here, the product to uh, join a circle community or a Discord server the pricing, the variation, and some options. Then you're going to click on save, and then you're going to set up the content, for example, for the product. This is the page where the client is going to have or to see after they have bought the product. They are going to see here a, a notice or a message from you, the file itself. So you are going to upload your file from here. 
like that and also we can add some pages just like that like their views and etc that was all for today's video uh here uh, i'm going to let you see here the share page as you can see when you finish everything you're going to publish it get that link and this is your um preview or the landing page of the product thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you in the next one